Amen. It's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest on 2K in existence. Look, we got a coming patch that's gonna give you a reason to play my career. NBA player skins? NBA face skins? We got some new patch information, okay, guys? They're patching again. More changes are coming, man. The modded controllers are testing. We now know the shooting boost, the contest boost. I'll tell y'all about some damn body glitches, okay? And the community is very unhappy on Twitter, man. We're gonna get into it. Now, before we get into that, y'all make sure y'all subscribe if y'all are new and hit that like button. It helps Young Swan grow. Now, firstly, right now, if you wanna play with Young Swan, man, follow my Twitter. Lord Baby Hawk on Twitch, easily the most entertaining 2K streamer to ever exist. It's not even close, man. Make the number go up, y'all. Now look, this dev is the my career dev. He already unfollowed me. He probably thought I was uh, one of these positive creators, right? I just be roasting the game. Now for him to respond to someone like me, it gotta mean something. I mean, use your head, cause I'll be flaming the game. Okay, I don't see why he would respond if he's not gonna eventually implement this. This is a huge W. Y'all let me know if I'm tripping or not. He basically wants to get into the heads of what would make you guys want to play my career. Of course, he's not talking about VC. He knows that's the main reason we would want to play my career for VC, right? You know, because <laughs> it's a hundred a build. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I give some good ideas. It only took me 30 seconds, guys. 30 seconds to come up with this, okay? Y'all let me know if you would play my career if this was actually true. I know you would, because I would. <laughs> I know how to put myself in other different perspectives. Casuals, comp players, you know? I have empathy, unlike most human beings, okay? I said cosmetics, mascots, new mascots, okay? Jerseys, actual NBA players that you can wear as a mascot for other modes. Imagine, bro, you could put on LeBron, you know, his whole body, the face scan, everything, his hair. Everyone would love that. They would be flooding my people would spend way more hours playing the game. Hopefully y'all don't monetize it, but we already know what they're going to do. This could even be for rewards in the game. I've been saying stuff like that, right? Because a lot of the uh, NBA players, they have haircuts that you cannot use on 2K. And even with the celebrities and stuff, it makes people very mad. And then even all the celebrities they put in the game. Now on PC, you see that they actually have Kai Sinat, Little Dirt. They're dribbling around with them on PC. So if you make those things either attainable through my career, people would play it way more. You know, you could earn Little Dirk or whatever damn celebrity or in different NBA players as mascots. People would love that. Okay. We love NBA players. We love the NBA. We might just want to get Jason Tatum or Wimby. Like you could have a baby Wimby, a damn 5'9 Wimby. Like that would be cool and it'd be hilarious. Or just the NBA player face scans, right? When you face scan normally, it looks off. If you give a their face scan y'all know how obsessed uh people are the drippy face scan every year they've been making the same for how many years bro bro the when did the drippy face scans begin i think it's 17 the drippy face scans begin maybe 16 they've been making that same every year and it gets like millions and hundreds of thousands of views but people love uh people would love the nba player face scans because what you have to choose from if you don't even want to face scan because it doesn't make your player look uh better it makes them look kind of weird but those nba player face scans people would love i, I ain't gonna hold it. and you know he says sick idea so this could either be in a future 2k 2k 26 i don't think it'll be implemented this year but hey let me know and look at this it's been like five something days they reset the records okay on a game we spend a hundred to build on okay still being looked into in the beginning of the year that they're not resetting records guys records are good for humanity the game making your game like that you are over catering to the negative win percent casual they are the majority listen i might hurt some of y'all's feelings okay <laughs> but it's time to tell y'all that real that harsh reality people rarely want to hear the truth but don't get mad learn to look at it from another perspective anyone promoting that they they want the records reset or the reason that 2k is trash their whole ideology how they feel about the game how they want the balancing how they want the gameplay is incorrect and it comes from a place of weakness and envy <laughs> and it's not realism it's not none of that 
okay they are just the bad people overall majority of them okay like they want to ruin all video games they don't want records in video games guys come on they want participation trophies in real life it's weird it's weird why can't we have a record because you don't want to be judged so you want to state things that you can't prove right people like to say oh they're this they're that they don't want to be judged and then they say in this and that and they're like man you're not really like that you can then see who they really are how good they really are by seeing that 2k card right and then if you guys say oh it makes people not want to play with me guess what there's a lot of people that are just like you you can find a bunch of people with horrible records play with them why are you trying to play with people way better than you, right you can find a bunch of people okay oh i play with my irls go play with all go play with everyone else who says i play with my irls then play with them because that's always the excuse to having a bad record go play with them and you know now look if you need people to play with follow me on twitch join my discord link is in description we got like thirty thousand people in there everyone join it and that'll help you out man but they even got a squad finder guys okay you should not be promoting records in video games now, i heard some interesting uh comments like maybe just started at season two because the game was completely broken in the start eh but that's giving it too much because then they might not have records in the game guys you need records guys. you don't have to take it serious but people still take it serious even if records reset i've tried it live people are still running people are still trying hard it doesn't matter do not want to lose period even if it's not recorded guys i promise you bro you play the game you could tell man but look y'all are a joke of a dev team look people are mad okay some people out there is acting like people want it like this how long is this wait for look laughing please fix it don't take that long been five days okay you see people are upset now a cool thing that i heard now if they did have a season record like a different record for every season that would be cool but i don't know if they're gonna be able to implement that now look bad says a week since season two came out and the records that we were told wouldn't reset still reset <laughs> we pay 100 a bill <laughs> chalk says i'd probably say they're not coming back if i had to guess look and there's something wrong with the game the copy paste that goddamn copy paste my boy i'm telling you bro the reason this even started the reason this even started is because it randomly happened right it randomly happened and then they act like they were going to implement it. i think it was 2k 23 i don't remember was it I think it was 23 or it was 24 one of those and the records reset the records were been resetting in the wreck and they didn't know and i told people and they didn't even know so then the records started resetting everywhere and then they're just like oh we're gonna just go with it but yeah lie w bad look hating on people and the only people who don't care about their record everyone somewhat cares about it are the horrible negative one percent who wants it to reset and they're gonna challenge and disrespect everyone with no proof you know the, how to quickly shut someone up that's saying like oh i'm trash all this and that oh your 2k card play me but they won't and look 2k toots did an extensive video on the perimeter buff okay he said before patch now after patch okay so now we can get more tights compared to pre-patch okay with your hands up i also did a jump okay the jump contest he said, now you get more tight, less light pressure. Y'all think this is a W? Now, I wonder what it was, because there's like three different versions. There's pre-patch, then there's the patch, and then there's the fix. So there's like three different times. I wonder like how it would be. 2K Tuts did another extensive test, okay? I'll be telling y'all about this. But if you're wide open, basically your jump shot is faster. And basically based off how covered you are, it's either faster or slower, okay? See, as you can see, light pressure, tight, very tight. So wide open is faster. Open is that. Light pressure is that. So, you know, light pressure, they saying this, he's saying it's slower. But look, then again, what you gotta understand is they move the green window. So you're randomly shooting slower and shooting faster. <laughs> And then this is combined. That's why you just have to focus on your visual cue, man. Because they're randomly, it's it's actually, and then you'll still miss even if you do time it right. It's kind of crazy, bro. Um, We're actually being given too much information. If you just play the game, focus on your visual cue, he gonna make you miss or you gonna make it. But trying to like overdo it, you just gonna stress yourself out, which is lame. You know, we gotta fight through the RNG. I did a test. I touched did a test. He said basically it was 8% overall buff and or touched it 
And 2K Lab is saying it's basically 3%, 7, 4. Overall, I don't know, man. I keep seeing people tweet casuals everyone's hitting everything all this and that i go play the game everyone's still missing i don't know what people are talking about everyone's still missing i'd be feeling like mike wang still playing god on my shot i see everyone missing um i don't know i don't think people are understanding how the algorithm works mike wang wants games to be close so when you're playing people and you're making shots he's gonna let them make shots easier that's probably what you got noticing. And then when you start blowing the team out, it's already built in comeback kid and it's gonna let them come back, guys. The algorithm's gonna help them. Gaming companies believe games like this keep people more enticed and on longer than just getting thrashed. It's not just about skill. You're literally playing versus algorithms, bro. I promise you, bro. Y'all, I'm not, it's not no conspiracy. I promise you. If you play the game, you really just like pay attention. You will see, bro. That's why you could feel like, man, I'm playing versus these bots and it's like why is this game type when then in a previous 2k it's just <clears throat> mike wang is playing god bro now look they done created full body hockey okay on 2k this was clean look full body hockey from one piece shout out to one piece now this is basically how you do the glitch on xbox okay and if you want to see him uh explain it it's very comprehensive you can go to his youtube channel check it out and uh i guess there's different type of whatever i don't know you can check it out man but man it seemed like he having a bad time on 25 man error coded twice in my first three games this season really can't enjoy this game then guess what you know he got banned <laughs> <laughs> look Alan tweets out, I just saw a Kia commercial, the main menu of 2K25. I would never have thought gaming would get to this point. Hey, <laughs> but they making us pay a hundred a bill, man. You got commercials out there. Come on, man. But yeah, he shows it. Shows on the gaming tab. Okay. Then it's a cry baby. People be tripping. Saying he basically posted this to show the direction of the gaming industry, man. Micro transactions, in-game ads, commercials on unfinished products. That's kind of crazy. Only a matter of time before we get mobile type ads that pause the gameplay. And you have to watch 30 second ad unless you pay to remove ads. Definitely. I heard you have to pay for audio on COD. What's going on, bro? Bro, we got to revolt, bro. <laughs> bro, do I have to become the 2K Gandhi? <laughs> Stop. Luck tweets out 2K destroying 6 6 builds is one of the worst things of NBA 2K25 forced everyone to be 5 9 6 4. Uh, the gameplay is just horrible overall. I've been playing on a little build all year. I finally went to play on a bigger build and it was so weird. I kind of had to adjust and I didn't have the 86 speed with ball. So I had like 75 and I had to kind of get used to it. It's just, it's so horrible that people that really like advocate for this gameplay and dribble system system are truly sellouts and they should not be supported in any sense bro like they're jokes people like that they create the war like if they wanted people to be smaller just make them quicker make them burst out quicker and all this and that you don't have to overdo it to where the, the bigger bills bigger bills they can still get somewhat busy but it's just the gameplay is just so horrible the dribbling is horrible um only being able to like cross launch being bigger it's just horrible whoever's idea was they're not a real 2k player just bad bro just horrible gameplay devs i'm not gonna hold it. horrible and it's not realistic what a bigger player can only cross launch that's what i'm saying guys they do this to try to cater to the negative one percent casual even though most casuals don't enjoy this game right they prefer golden era s gameplay um my team breakout got fixed i don't really know what this is um i don't know where my rep boost is uh, do y'all know how to get the rep boost bro i played in basketball gods i don't know man stats tweeted out i love that my court is back. Why don't we have any type of customization for it like it was in 16 and 17? I think you can change the wall. Now, isn't that crazy? How, what is it, nine, nine, ten years? How you got more customization on an old game? Isn't that weird, bro? And things look better on an old game, like better parks, all that. Isn't that sad? It's a sick. Hey, y'all click on the video on the screen if you want to become a dribble guy. For all builds, you want to see the best dribble moves. Well, hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this for when this hit the fan. Everything I'm that made me. Now break it down, yo, off the top of the dome, dome.